Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Kindergarten 2. I'm Doom Dragon. And I'm Karen Maku. And this episode, we are doing crap. What was the mission? Things, Things that, go, that boom. go boom. Yeah. Because I don't know. Breaking sad, you have to annoy Miss Applegate once with Sydney, then once by yourself. And I don't know how to do that. I do. Shut up. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to do. Also, I'm still wearing the holiday outfit, but it's March as of recording this, so it's St. Patty's Day. Yes, I'm part of All right. Okay, okay uh, so how do we start? Give Carla the laser module. New kids. You want this? What the? No way. Where'd you, where'd you get this? How'd you get it? This is incredible. With this, I can finally... Buy what? Kid, clear your schedule. We got a lot of work to do. What are you talking about? Right over there. I'm very tired and I'm stressed out and I'm not having a good time. With this laser module, we and with that other principal's kid transferring, I could finally get, I could finally go through with that, with my little project. You see, I'm pretty good about getting around the, uh, getting around the school. I've got keys, secret passages, and I know how to tangle with Stevie. He has very weak elbows. If you go for the ankles, he can't chase you. One problem I've never been able to solve is getting a uh, getting a passage to the to the teacher's lounge to the janitor's closet. How does the laser help? Yeah, have you not been reading your lines this whole time? No, I was. Okay. On its on its own, it doesn't. But I heard about the stuff that went on at your old at your other school. There's a lot of stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> Uh, that was a train. That place was a train wreck. I'm talking. Uh, I'm talking about the little pocket bombs that listen to, listen to your conversations. Oh uh, yeah, those sucked. I need one, and you're going to get it for me. Your friend with the cry. Uh, your friends with the crying kid over there, right? Not really. Well, you're gonna be. Find him a tissue or something. Maybe you can cheer him up, and he'll get. Uh, he'll give you one of those devices. Where can I get a tissue? I know where to get a tissue. Probably someone who thinks she's a princess. Pigtails over there might fit the bill. It's worth a shot. Okay, cool. I like the way we walk. Hidden hidey hole. Okay, I'm just uh, haven't finished Leprechaun. I'm not gonna watch Leprechaun 2 Back to the Hood. Well, I mean, I'm gonna watch Leprechaun. Was it, was it too much for you? It's too much. I'm gonna watch Leprechaun Origins though because it's 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 so fucking stupid. Cause it's designed to reboot the series, but you know how in the movies Leprechaun's like the little guy who's like, oh he's making jokes and he's like, oh, did I, oh you shouldn't let us with the Leprechaun and his gold little lady. <laughs> and then in the final movie he's like, hey, I'm Chad. <laughs> he's a, he's, it's like a just a feral monster that like attacks people and takes its gold. Wait, really? Yeah, man. It doesn't make any sense at all. This new uh, this new school is more my style, especially due to this the new selection of boys. What do you I think? I don't care. So we were together. Uh, ouch. Ouch. Okay, yeah. It's yeah, tissue. Okay. Things to do. Fuck you, you blonde bimbo. Don't call a six-year-old a bimbo. <laughs> I probably shouldn't. That's you. Wait, kid. I want to talk about it. You look like you could use this. <laughs> Here, m'lady. <laughs> God, Thanks. imagine if they, well, imagine if people who said that actually said it to, like, everyone. <laughs> I'm so tired. Thanks, man. I can't believe they made me come to school today. Why? What's wrong? I don't go to, you know what, what's the difference? You know why we're at this school instead of our old one? No. Also, if it's 11 by the time we stop recording. Oh, it crashed. You owe me. Uh oh. Uh yes. You, uh, oh, that's you. Oh right. Uh, you do? How did you find out? I only know because I found the body parts. Uh, it was on the news. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, 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 we're, we kids watch the news, don't we? Yeah, eight-year-olds watch the news. How? We're not. How are we? Six-year-olds. How are we? We're six, four-year-olds. Six or seven. <laughs> They're in kindergarten. It's six or seven. Is it? Yeah, I had to go to kindergarten at the age of seven because my birthday was so late in the year. Hmm. 
I don't remember kindergarten. I don't remember a lot of my childhood. I blocked it out. You seem to remember the time you tried to drown yourself at the dock. No, I don't remember that. Okay. Grandma told me about it. Okay. It's funny, she actually thought she was telling a story about my dad at first. <laughs> Jeez, you know. That means your dad did the same thing at some point. <laughs> I guess so, and then they just... Literally, the only reason she realized it was a story about me instead was because a different family member who was there who hadn't been born until, like, uh, my dad was, like, closer to an adult. Okay. I still like to uh, imagine that means your dad also tried to drown himself at the dock. Probably plumbers don't want to live. <laughs> we really just don't. Okay, but, yeah, we do. I got an uncle who got bit by a rattlesnake a while back. Uh... Oh yeah, I guess that makes sense. So you know what I have to do then, right? Find a foster family? Avenge your father, Batman style? I have a mom! Jeez! I have to take revenge on who did this to my family! Who do you think did this? Lily, obviously! She was obsessed with my dad. It had to be her. She's not even here. Dude, ever since I found out that there's a snake that has a spider for a tail, I haven't been okay. I'm just, I'm not okay. Isn't that just the, the, the face huggers from the Alien movie? No. Because, like, think of that, but reversed. I know it's reversed, but, like, it's basically that. The only thing is it's backwards. I guess so. It uses its spider tail to attract birds that it eats, and that is just information I'm not okay with. I like to imagine that it does fly away with the snake, but the snake gets the last laugh. <laughs> God damn it. I mean, because it's like, birds can pick up snakes. They can. <laughs> That's what you think. I know she's here. I can feel it in my bone blood stuff. <laughs> can you help me find her? Please. I guess I can help you. I need justice. He pulls down a Batman cowl. He becomes six feet tall. <laughs> it's like one of those shitty party city Batman costumes, though. Thank you. Now we just need to get a lead of some sort. Talk to Nugget. He was close to Billy and had a crush on Lily. Maybe he knows. Okay. Oh man, it's so silly that Billy and Lily knew each other. For a second I was like, wait, didn't you need three things to get to do this quest? Why do you only have two? And I forgot you gave Carla the laser. Alright, uh, do you know where Lily is? Nugget does not feel like answering that question right now. Get Nugget out of here! Uh, what do you want me to do about it? Find help! As teacher, or janitor, or principal! Nugget does not care. Just get Nugget out of here. Oh, crap. Uh, are we going to be able to do this? I don't know. Um. Uh, let's see. Teacher, you, uh, you can't, okay, so you can't get help from Bob with, unless you have the tool belt. Do we need to go back and get the tool belt? You can't bring the tool belt because you, you only carry three items. Right. Uh, Shit. Uh. Teacher or janitor. I'm pretty sure janitor will kill me, so... I bet the apple gate. I get stuck in the, the sewer grate. Oh. Does Doesn't he have any, any pills on uh, him? Okay, I'm sorry. I thought he could stay down there. One less kid for me to worry about today. Why are you taking my lines? I don't know. You weren't reading them. I was going to. <laughs> you jumped in front of me. You're a peach with peach shaped boobies. I wonder how like peach came to be a, not, uh, uh, like a metaphor for a butt. Because a bud shaped like a peach? I guess so. I've also heard people say onion booty, which I don't really understand what that means. It smells like, it smells like shit. <laughs> no, it's like the butt is shaped like an onion and I don't, I don't get that. Can you like- Sorry, zoned out thing. <laughs> I'm so tired. Also a little drunk maybe. It's stuck in the sewer gate. Nuggets dying! Oh, odd little child. Yes, I'm aware of the situation. You gonna do anything about it? Most certainly. I wouldn't just leave a... I wouldn't just leave a student trapped in a sewer. The fire department is on their way to get him out. Thanks, I'll let him know. Oh, that won't be necessary. I'll have my sister watch over him. Oh, Margaret! Huh? What? Ah, the sunlight, it burns! And, and she just, just, like, turns to ash. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh, forgot about that. Forgot about that little thingy. That he does, she does. It's just her quirk, you know. She's just quirky. Sometimes she, she she's turns... like a she's like a phoenix. She'll come back. Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> she did last time, so like you know, hopefully she only does. She, hopefully she doesn't just get the one. Behind you, sweetheart. <laughs> she only gets one resurrection, but nobody knows that. Oh, how can 
can I be of service? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, are, just, you, are you alright? Just the, she only gets one resurrection. There's a boy trapped in the uh, shit. <laughs> there's, there's a boy trapped in the sewer, sewer grate. Go keep him company. Yes, principal sister, dear. And then she falls. She like goes up and's like, child. <laughs> Tries to touch him with her weird old lady hands. What's wrong with her? Oh, I'm not really sure. It must be all the new students ha have her a little on edge. Did she call you sister? She did. We we're having. Uh, she was having a. Uh, she was having trouble finding a job, and I couldn't let the poor thing starve. Right. Yeah. Children's souls are so easy to come by here, and she just can keep on trucking. Uh, look at Jerome's fucking face. He's like, oh. He looked like that in the last game. He got that. He got the, the right skin. That light skin grizzly. Mm. Don't call him that. <laughs> uh, you're you're keeping in company, right? Guard the boy. Right. Guard the child. No. <laughs> the child is fine. He will be preserved. Are you okay in there, Nugget? Nugget is not happy. Nugget is not like the creepy lunch lit. The, the boy, boy is it's... fine. <laughs> Sorry, you were reading it. I know, I know. I'm also out of it. Uh, the boy is fine. If you continue to make him upset, you will have to be removed. Removed? Yes. Removed. I'm not leaving. Yes, you are. Oh, sh oh Jesus. Man. But you got her outfit. One solid hit. You got her outfit. Did you get it? No. Good job. Well, we okay, gotta start let's over. Yeah, let's talk to Carlos. Okay, just speed uh, through it. So, how was your day? Bad. Why was it bad? Because I'm stressed out because we're getting an apartment and it's a bunch of financial bullshit that I'm worried about. We're not going to be able to afford and we have a very flimsy plan at best. Cody, you... Oh, shoot. Crap. Oh, wait. I know where Billy is. See and how... Oh, shit. <laughs> well... <laughs> This is why you need to pay attention when you're doing that. Yay. Uh, Do you want this? But, like, Cody, we can afford it. You're just really nervous because your mom was terrible at uh, financial uh, planning. Well, also, furnishing is going to cost a lot. Well, yeah, but we're going to get a credit card and, like, slowly furnish our place, so it's fine. Mm -hmm. Something bad happened. They found my dad in some weird lab under his office. His head was missing. How awful. So now you know what I have to do then, right? Well, I'll find a father okay, family. This is what do you the, think? She's not even here. here. I He's guess I can help you. you. Okay. okay, then. So... I don't think you can get the, uh... Let's see. Hang on, hang on. Uh... Uh... Do you know where Lily is? You already tried that! Well, I don't know what else to do! Uh, what do you want me to do about it? What else? I don't know what else to do. Ask the scary janitor, baby. Uh, I guess that's not so great. Stop talking to the janitor. Are you okay, then? Uh, wait, maybe if we talk to Jerome. He's stuck behind the grate. We need to get him out of there. It's our own idea. I'll figure something out. Uh, Crap. Shit, because, like, Bob doesn't. Bob won't help. Uh, trapped in sewer. Yeah, if only it is told out. And then the principal just gets you the lunch lady. Because it's like, I'm pretty sure we do need to get down there. Yeah, yeah, right. Hang on, can I see the mission map? And also, did we, come, did we get any hints? Hmm. Yeah, because all it says is to start the mission by giving Carla the laser module. This room does this this game does not give you step by step. Sorry. Uh. Oh yeah, I guess we don't get any hints in this game. That's weird. Shit. What do we do? I don't know. How should I know? Can I ask the scary teacher? Why supposed, are you, oops, I, why'd you, oh my god, I'm sorry. Cody, do you, I know, I'm stupid, okay? You're not stupid. Just, you, you need to calm down. I'm fine. You don't seem fine. I'm fine. Okay, it, we needed the letter A, the letter plane, and later. 
Yeah, we can only bring three items, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, kindergarten. All right. Uh, Do you want this? Okay, so we give her this. Passage, train wreck. Give Jerome a tissue. Maybe if we, wait, maybe if we talk to... Yeah. Maybe if we talk to Carla after we deal with Jerome. Jerome. Then that just circumvents the whole risk of us getting blown up. Maybe if we hang on, let me try talking to Carla. He wants to find Lily. Okay, maybe maybe the, maybe we're just stupid. Uh hmm. She was the girl whose brother went missing, right? Interesting. You know, I did see two kids sneak into the uh, sneak into the crawl space under the school. Could it be them? It wouldn't surprise me. Since that nugget kid came, came in my secret passage this morning, we need to find another way down there. So it's your fault our precious nug is stuck down there. No, it's Nugget's fault. Because it, it was a working secret passageway and then he uh, caved it in. Remember when I lost my shit in the middle of a Walmart because of the plant-based chicken nuggets called Nugs that was just a chicken and someone forcefully pointing a nugget at it? Yeah. Happy days. Uh, what are our options? I say we go through go through that grate. Here's a scoot. Here's a screwdriver. Uh, let that nugget kid out. I'll distract Bob so he doesn't notice it open. Why don't we just get Bob to do it? Because Bob will put the grate back on. We need it off so we can get down there. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, now she's gonna distract Bubble. The Bibble. The Bobinator. Uh, yeah, gonna try. I'm gonna get you out of. Don't worry, I'll save you! And we stab him with the screwdriver. Shoot, are we gonna be able to get down there? I don't know. Nugget is free! Thank you for freeing Nugget. No problem. Uh, nice job, kid. So this is Nugget, huh? It is. Yes. Nugget is Nugget. Who is Ponytail Girl? I'm Carla. Say, you wouldn't happen to have... Uh, you wouldn't have... You wouldn't have happened to see anyone down there. Perhaps some kids in hoodies? Uh, Nugget is not supposed to say it. Only those with the secret stuff creature may know. Right. The secret. Uh, I haven't... I've heard enough. Meet me in the smart kids class. We got work to do. Will do. It's the bell. Everyone go to sign classroom. We go to smart times today. Huh. <laughs> uh, What'd you say? Because he calls. He 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 call, He he says. He said. He calls. Uh, he says. The, Calm yourself. He says, like, prove that you are smarter than the other slugs you call classmates. I thought it was peers. Whatever. Uh. Okay, so now we go talk to Carla. Yeah. <laughs> Good, you're here. Uh, we need to get down to the crawl space to confirm if that girl is here. And how do we get there? Oh. Why do you think? Why do you think I had you open that grate? Yeah. It'll be easy enough. Here's uh, here's the key to the door that'll lead to the handicap ramp. Uh, let's go take let's go take our assessment so Danner lets us out. You're coming with me. I'm only following you downstairs. I'll make sure Stevie doesn't stop you from using that key. Got it. Let's go. Yeah, we've heard this one before. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. He's just upset he's spaghetti because there's only toilet paper and a spray bottle. Oh, I'm a whiny little boy. Shut up, Jerome. I'll throw a piece of plastic at you. I'll, I'll be the piece of plastic that's thrown at you. Uh, which thing do we take? Uh, da, ba, ba, da, or does it matter? Uh, just take either or. I'll take the spray bottle because I can spray it in Stevie's eyes if he chooses to be a little bastard. <laughs> Okay, let's go. D Danner probably won't stop us now. Okay. <laughs> Alright, cool. Let's get out of here. And just where do you two think you're going? Uh, the bathroom. Together? No. <laughs> okay. Just don't cause any trouble. Hello, pot-smoking <laughs> child. Hey, the boys' room is downstairs. He can go, but you can't. Relax, man. The student handbook says I'm allowed to assist a new, a new student with finding the bathroom. 
Oh. Okay. I didn't know that. Thanks. My pleasure. Y'all carrying? Yeah. You sharing? No. <laughs> wow, that guy's that guy is dumb, but Stevie isn't. Once he sees us, he'll take me back upstairs. He's not dumb. He's just high as a kite, and I envy him for it. Is this, is this panel dark? Yes, it is. It's been a very long day of kindergarten. <laughs> Isn't kindergarten just like a couple hours? It's like nowhere near as long as an actual school day. It's uh, it's less than the later uh, grades. Oh well. While he's doing that, use the key to get to get out before he comes back. Got it. I have a plan. We just jump off the stairs and directly onto his head. <laughs> uh, we need to get back to class before the bell rings. I'll make another distraction so you up uh, for you so Stevie doesn't see you come come in from outside. Just don't be late. I won't be. She just starts Good. a fire. Good, let's go. <laughs> hey, Carla, you're not supposed to be downstairs. The girl's bathroom is upstairs. The other monitor should have stopped you. Sorry. <laughs> well, stop it. Oh, that's right. Silly me. Maybe you should walk me up there to make sure I don't make any more mistakes. Don't play dumb with me. Come on, let's take you back upstairs. Run, Cody! Run! I'm a shifty-eyed little monster. Run, Cody! Uh, unlock the door with the power of keys. Uh, and I go here. Yeah, you run to the front of the school. Yeah. And go down the grade. And I go home. Uh, hey, body bags. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Oh, what do you want to do here? Bus. Squeak the plushie. And then we just get blown to bits. That's the signal. Uh, I think that's you, actually. It's safe to come out. Finally. I feel like I've been waiting... Uh, I've been waiting in there for hours. Who are you guys? Well, yeah, we should probably tell you that I am tired. Hey, we got robes. It's us, Lily and Billy. Ain't that silly. We've been spying on this new school and we've discovered a lot. You want to hear about it? Sure. Yeah, sure. I don't really care, but sure. Well, it turns out the three kids who were rezoned to another school weren't actually rezoned. They're here. They're deep under the school. That elevator has a secret eye scanner that gives you access to go, to go way underground. Way up the butt. Okay. <laughs> I think they're using them for experiments like they did with me. We have to help them. What do you need? Our original plan was to tunnel down there with digging equipment, but that might take too long. Our other option is to get past that eye scanner. What do we do? Or how do we do it? By getting Penny down here. She's a robot, which means she can be controlled. The teachers get these little remotes that control her. Which is also why the, uh, the lights go out when the kids get sent to the principal's office. It's voice activated and calls Penny to take out the kid who's who is misbehaving. Right. So we need that remote. Can you get it for us? If not, we'll just have to start digging. He runs after Lily. Me? Oh, I guess he blames me for what happened to his dad. Can't imagine why. I'm the one who pressed the button. <laughs> I'm the one who did the deed. Yeah, I enjoyed every minute of it too. And I'd fucking do it again. We should have seen this coming, Billy. What's the big deal? He can't get to us. He doesn't even know we're here. And then Jerome comes in with a shotgun and he's like, Just wait a minute. He, like, tries to cock it, but he can't reach it. <laughs> we can't risk it. I have to confront him. Uh, he has to know the truth about his father. Head back upstairs and tell Jerome to meet me in the girls' bathroom. God, that's hard to read. Knock, knock on the first stall twice. Ah, uh, yes. Neon yellow on light baby blue. <laughs> Perfect color sequencing. You should get back to class before the bell rings. You don't want to get to study hall. Good idea. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Go! Uh, go! Oh no! Uh, oh god! Let me. Just, there we go. Uh, Run! Uh, Run! Uh, where's the front doors of the school? Oh, there they are. <laughs> hey, Shiri, is my friend still in the? She just comes up and hits him in the back of the head with a shovel. <laughs> All right, that'll distract him for a while. Unacceptable, Kala. I'm giving you study hall. You're not supposed to be down here. 
I'm walking here. Come on, man. I'm just checking on my friend. He has turbo diarrhea. <laughs> He's not okay. It's diarrhea that goes so fast it shatters any toilet you sit on. <laughs> He's quantum shitting through the nth dimension right now. He's not okay. <laughs> Do the toilets have safety straps? My god, if not. <laughs> He's going into hyperspeed. <laughs> Shifting the <her> colors. <laughs> it's going to ludicrous speeds. <laughs> I'm tired and a little bit drunk. He's fine. See? Now get back upstairs before I send you to the principal's office. Okay, fine. Jeez. Get up there, you pretty bitch. I mean... <laughs> and you, you had long enough for your bathroom break. Back upstairs now. Okay, relax. You think I give a shit if you're turbo shitting? I don't. Or maybe I do. I'll be the judge of if you're turbo shit, and then he goes into the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Examine the toilet. <laughs> Open the septic tank. <laughs> Good, you're back. I'll take that key. So, so what's the deal? Are those kids down there? Can we get Jerome to them? They'll be in the girls' bathroom. Good. Let's uh, let's tell that crybaby the good news. Let's go. Go, Cody! Stop yawning and I tell him! I can't stop! I'm so tired. I make a mistake. Uh, did you put my, um, creamer in the fridge? I did. Okay, good. Now the question is, are you actually gonna use it? I'll try, goddammit. Did you find out anything about Lily? Do you know where she is? She'll be in the, uh, she'll be in the bathroom during lunch. Good. <laughs> so she is here. I knew it. Pulls down a Batman cowl. I'm gonna get her for what she did. Thanks, kid. And he pulls out like a grappling hook and just grapples away. <laughs> <laughs> he is in the smart class. Danner wouldn't stop him. <laughs> I, I have a plan to get you there. Uh, we'll talk during lunch. That little bastard stole my grappling hook. Damn it. I know I should have put I knew I should have put it on the top shelf. If only I didn't have these little stubby arms. All the nutrients went to my brain, not my arms. Damn it! <laughs> Now I have these tiny little noodles. Will you please? Because <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Losing our minds. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm gonna die. No, you won't. You'll survive. I won't survive. Let's watch Chicken Little after no. this. <laughs> <laughs> it's trying to declare psychological warfare on me. Yeah. You, uh, if I wanted to do that, I'll just say, we, let's watch Strange Magic. Uh, or White Chicks. <laughs> I need to get upstairs to that bathroom. I got some extra burgers like you asked. What are they for? Stevie got a little extra irritated with me today, so now I have study hall. I'm not going to the principal's office for uh, for all this. So, what can we do? Uh, we're going to start a food fight. It'll draw the, all the... It'll draw in all the monitors and give you a chance to leave. Uh, we just need someone big and dumb enough to start it. Oh, uh, ho, ho, I know a thing or two about big and dumb. I know a little bit about being framed for killing my father. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have you know I myself am big and dumb. Uh, okay, then. We just need to find someone willing to start it. Once it starts, there should be enough chaos for you to get, uh, for you to get out of here. Got it. One more thing. While you're upstairs, get into the science class and change the lesson plans to robotics. I'm going to need some... <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna need some of that stuff to finish our little project. Got it. Sorry, Jerome, I'm on her side, not yours. Burger's okay, but I actually kind of wish to slump. God, are you Just making- Just keep getting deeper. <laughs> hey, you wanna start a food fight? <laughs> yeah, I do. This place could use a little redecorating. So could Nugget's face. Let's do it. Easy there, kid. I'm not starting a fight without proper ammunition. You want more food? Yep, bring me more burgers. We'll kick this food fight off right. Okay. Uh, you can have mine. How many do you need now? One more should do it. Go get one. Hurry up. Okay, well, let's go. Move your fat green ass. Talk <laughs> to the lunch lady. You can't just take the burgers. Uh, why not? Because you need to pay for them. I don't. 
She can't tell. She's probably blind. Well, she did take a dollar from you. <laughs> I just handed her a piece of paper. Let's get the show on the road. He just starts eating them. <laughs> I just lied to you because I'm poor. <laughs> and hungry. Hey, Nugget. Nugget does not wish to speak to... Catch! That was a pretty good throw. Yeah. <laughs> Nugget does not like beggars. And he just starts, like, melting. <laughs> no! Nah. Disintegrates into Nuggets. <laughs> Hey, fatso, watch it. You almost hit me with that grease ball. Oh, my mistake. I'll make sure to hit you this time. Except they're not good at aiming at anyone but Nugget. <laughs> it just looks like <laughs> auto-aim on. <laughs> hey, that was rude. Come on, weird kid. We didn't have to put up with this. Let's give him a taste of his own medicine. Nugget had never considered throwing food back at the nasty bully. Nugget normally just poisons his enemies. Thought so Nugget could make an exception this time. This time. Pulls out an AK. <laughs> <laughs> Nugget is ready for war! What the heck? I don't want to be involved in your stupid... Food fight! The movie? Oh. <laughs> I ruined it for you. Oh. <laughs> Unacceptable. This will not stand in my cafe. Oh. Press the button. Oh, everybody just chose violence. Perhaps I should get my sister. <laughs> <laughs> she trips and falls. Breaks her head. Okay, we should leave. Janitor is just participating, I guess? No, he's yelling because he has to clean this up. Okay. Uh, so what do we do first? Bathroom or science lab? Oh, uh, fuck, man. I don't know. Science lab it is. <laughs> Third of the classroom. Oh, it's locked. Oh yeah, we have uh, to get in there through the the, 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 the girls' bathroom. Which, Knock on the first stall twice. Are you sure? Well, I mean, oh, that's I literally what stall. she said. I guess first stall would be this stall, huh? <laughs> Hello, Jerome. <laughs> he just, like, does not hesitate and shoots her. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's sitting on the toilet with a cat on her lap. It's like, hello, <laughs> Mr. Bond. <laughs> oh, and the toilet rotates. <laughs> She's like, how did you... I really fucked up the plumbing. The girl's bathroom comes with a lot of bonuses. Amenities. <laughs> Watch this. And then, like, the whole bathroom just warms up. It's like, it's heated in here. And this. She snaps her finger and a disco ball comes down. <laughs> Lily, you, 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 you with the, you, you with the, you, you, my, you killed my father. No, I am your father. And she rips off a mask and she's the guy. She certainly is dead. No one would suspect that Lily, the one who's been after me this whole time, would also be me. <laughs> but I'm also, and he rips off the mask, Billy. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, how could you? That's right, son. This has been a long, elaborate plan to keep you off my trail. <laughs> but I'm not just Billy. I'm and he rips the mask off. Al Capone. <laughs> and this was a very elaborate plan to escape the cops. <laughs> I'm also your mother. <laughs> she walked out when you were born. <laughs> now I'm going to do what he should have done. I'm going to stop your crazy conspiracy theories. Jerome, wait. I can explain everything. Liar. I know we're Bill. She's not lying. And we hit him with a shovel. Where did we get the shovel? Well, I mean, there's one in the janitor's closet. All right. What? Of course she's lying. She's just trying to save herself. Jerome, sorry, I'm very hungry. <laughs> Did you ever stop to consider why your dad had explosives and why they blew, why they blow up when you mentioned my brother? Shut up! I'm sure there was a reason. It's because you're unstable. He knew you were after him. Yeah, because he kidnapped my brother and turned him into a monster that makes pills. See, that does sound crazy. You were there. You tell him. It's all true. It is true. You good? There it is. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Wait, you were there? 
You saw everything? She's telling the truth? Yeah, when I told you I saw everything on the news, I was lying. She was my mom, and also Al Capone, and also Billy, and also my dad. And also Weird Al Yankovic, and it's like, I never said that. <laughs> oh, you caught me, rips the mask off. <laughs> oh, God. I miss Weird Al Yankovic. Yeah, he's he's still not makes, dead. He's still making stuff. <laughs> I know. Why are you saying it like he's dead? <laughs> Listen, man, I miss a lot of things. I miss back in the 1800s when you could just do cocaine casually. And, like, people moderated themselves, God damn it! Why are you saying it like you were there? No reason. <laughs> like, I don't know, I miss when cocaine was classy, and, like, rich people would just be like, oh, just give me a second. And they just, like, snort a couple of, like, tiny little pinches of cocaine. It's like, alright, I'm good to go. Like, back when cocaine was- back when drugs were fun! Can you please? And then my dad was- he was- oh, jeez, I think I'm gonna be sick. There, there, stupid. <laughs> Here. Here's a hat that I found in the bathroom. <laughs> a barf hat. Oh no, it's a sp it's spittoon. I'm sorry. <laughs> it can be more than one thing. Hi everyone, we're back. Cody accidentally hit a button and turned off the recording. I'm very stupid. Nah, uh, you're uh, okay. I don't know what point it cut off, but... I think it was during this sentence because I was scratching my leg. Alright, uh, bye Lily. Go... Do whatever. Ah, oh, Gerald's back to crying like a bitch. Okay, we have a problem. Penny's coming up the stairs. I think she knows where I am. We need to get out of here now. What do we do? There's got to be another way out of here. Help me, help me find it, or we're all dead. All right, fine. God, you're not gonna shut up and whine about it, I guess. Okay, per that's perfect. Come on. Uh, we gotta go. All right. We should be safe. Uh, we should be safe here. She won't be looking for long. What now? I gotta head back down to, uh, to Billy. Uh, oh God, I can't read. Uh, we still have a lot of work to do. I'm, I'm sure there's something you can do here to wait out the time before recess. Alright. Good, good luck. And Jerome, I'm sorry. Okay, cool. Are you okay? I'm fine. Do you want to talk about it? No, I'm fine. Do you want to come back? I haven't moved. Uh, it doesn't... Uh. How did you get into my science classroom? Explain yourselves! And we snuck in through the vents. Oh. That's rather clever. Not clever enough to avoid study hall, but still. Clever. Oh, man. Uh, okay. Look at all the bad children today. My word, there are a lot of you. To make matters worse, I did not get my coffee. No one move or talk. Just, just be quiet. Say nothing. I'm just gonna close my eyes real quick. You okay? Alright, now Danner is asleep. Okay then. Did you get, uh, did you get your work... Uh, did you work through your issues, Jerome? I guess I did. I'm still processing it all, but I feel a little better. Good. So you're okay with parting with that little device of yours? Oh, I already did. I think I left it on the bathroom floor upstairs. Great. Okay, kid. Let's go up and grab the thing. What about Danner? What about him? The guy didn't get his coffee today. He'll sleep like a baby until the bell rings. Oh. We'll be fine as long as we're back before he wakes up. Let's go. Okay, cool. So, you okay? You're real quiet now. I'm fine. What are you rotten kids doing up here? We're looking for a little device that was left on the ground. Have you seen it? <laughs> Maybe I have. What's in it for me if I tell you? I don't know. What do you want? Well, the cafeteria needs some cleaning spray since your little hooligans tore it up. And the toilet paper needs to place it in the ball's room. We can do that. Good. Come back when you do. Be right back. Okay, uh, cool. So now you gotta walk out so that you can get Carla's thing. Uh, what price did you pick for taking the assessment today? Cleaning spray. Cool, I got the toilet paper. Head down to the cafeteria and drop it uh, drop that off. Meet me back here as soon as possible. Cool. 
Okay, cool. So, uh, do I give it to Stevie? I don't know. I'm just jogging hey, up. Whoa, you're not supposed to be in study hall. You're supposed to be in study hall. You, you being out here is that acceptable? I'm sending you to the. I'm just delivering some cleaning spray. Yeah. Okay. Calm down, you little freak. Oh well. Okay. Thanks. I'll get back to study hall. You're welcome. Okay, back up to the janitor. There you are. So you dropped off the uh, spray bottle, right? Yeah. Awesome. Uh, let's go get that device from the uh, from that old coot. We're gonna blow the lid off this place. All right. You done doing my job for me? You bet. <clears throat> Good. Maybe you kids aren't all bad after all. Maybe I shouldn't have hit so many of you with my mop. That would that would have been nice. Well then, you can leave me alone now. Uh, what about the device? The what? Oh yeah, the little doodad. I put it in the weapons closet. It's on my cleaning cart. Bobo left the door unlocked. Looks like he was tripping on something in there. You don't even have it with you? Come on, man. Deal with it, kid. I'll let the hall kid know to let you in. Now get out of here before I change my mind about hitting kids with my mop. Get out of here. Well, let's head down there. We're almost out of time. You alright? I'm fine. You're just really quiet now. I'm fine, Lonnie. Oh, it's pretty bad. Hard to breathe in here. Uh, once I blow a hole in the wall, it'll air out nicely. Probably snap Bob out of his little trance. Uh, let's get the device and get out of here. If we stay here too long, we'll end up like him. Got it. Wait, so does that mean Bob dies by the end of this game? Yeah. You don't save him. Chainsaw and a shovel. Isn't this? It's in the, uh, cart. Take the device. I don't know how much longer we can last like this. Uh, we gotta get the heck out of here. Got it. Okay. Billy and Lily die. Yeah. <laughs> Unless you explicitly save them. Yeah. Wait, no. Where are you? Where are you going? Sorry, where am I going? You're going to back to study hall. Okay. Uh, uh, get st okay. Yeah, it's just telling us to. You don't forget get back to pay to the lab seats. fee. How much is the lab fee? Three dollars. Uh, what? Oh, must have dozed off for a moment there. Uh, right. Anyone who wants to come to science class, come pay your lab fee. Otherwise, go to the gym. Go to science. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about robotics. That's odd, but I thought it was plants. Anyway, robots are a wonderful way to terrorize the tri-state area. In front of you is one of my favorite kinds of robot, the hydraulic press. Do we have any volunteers to stick their head under it? Anyone? You kids are no fun. Just go stick those spare parts together until something lights up. Okay, now we can move, so let's talk to Carla. Uh, it's time to break that sucker. Uh, time to break the sucker down. We need to detonate it without triggering the mechanism, so it doesn't blow our heads off. Okay, don't read. Sorry, how do we do that? That's a good question. Maybe someone, uh, maybe someone from your old school has experience dealing with this sort of thing. I'll ask around. Yeah, robots are cool and all, but none of this stuff here comes close to what I've made. Can you deactivate this? You know I can, but you also know I won't be doing it for free. How much? 20 bucks. That's so expensive. Yeah, so are my medical bills. Now put up a shut up. Is there anything else I can do? Hmm, maybe there is something. I've seen you hanging out with Kyle all day. Are you on good terms with her? I guess so. Good, good. So what do you say you drop a good word about me to her? Maybe set us up on a little date? I can try. 
Well, you better try hard. Either you can give me 20 bucks, or you can set me up on a date with her. Got it? Got it. Okay. Well, did you find anything? Uh, did you find anyone to do it? Monty will. Okay, so why isn't he doing it? He wants to be your boyfriend. Ugh, that grimy little... You know what? Fine. But I'm not happy about it. That's how relationships are. Okay, fine. Jeez. Do you want Do you want to break up? No. You can get a divorce if you want. Nah, I think it's just school relationships. Did you? Were right. you not happy in school? Not because I was dating you. I was just not happy in school because my life sucked. Okay. <clears throat> I guess I should probably say business-related relationships because that's why he's dating her for business deals. Just like in the good old days when you could just marry your daughter off to a guy for goats. Did you ask her? What did she say? She said yes. Okay. Hot diggity dog. I can't wait. We'll be a force to be reckoned with. So about the device. And thunder just cracks. <laughs> There's like, it's sunny outside. How did that even... Uh, Oh yeah, this will just take a minute. There's also no windows in this room. Yeah. There, I disabled the listener on it. It won't pop unless you give it a different method of exploding. Thanks, Monty. <laughs> You're a doll. Okay, cool. So now we put the thing in the thing, and then we put the the, the, the turn the thing on, and right. yeah, sounds good. Come on. Get crushing. The crushing. Go up the stairs. Your stairs. Uh, place the device, and then go hit the button. It looks like pressing this bundle trying to crush her. Turn on the crushinator. You did it! This is exactly what I need to finish the bomb! I could totally blow open the wall now! Hooray! It's kind of saying that in front of the teacher. Shoo, she doesn't and the care. Robot. She doesn't care either. Look at her, she's uh, zoned out. Leave without breaking anything. What if I do break things on the way out? No. Wait, really? That's it? What? That's like the end of the school day? Yeah, all, all she right. wanted was the bomb. No. Oh. I guess what it was. Alright. No, 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 no. Okay. What a day! I can't believe we're uh, we were able to build this thing so quickly. And you want to uh, you want to know what the cherry on top is? What? Uh, I had enough parts to make two bombs. How sick is that? Uh, you can have one for yourself. Wow. Since it uses Penny's text, she won't recognize it as contraband. So have fun with that. I'm sure. I'm sure. But I can't read. I'm sure we'll be working together again soon. Yeah, maybe. You can also have this Monster Mon card. I'm just... I'm just that impressed. Later, kid. Later. You're dating a guy in a wheelchair. Okay, cool. Yeah, we got the undercover suits. Nice. The fuck a tornado. Oh, have you seen the new policy changes to YouTube? No, does it suck? Actually, no, it's really good. Really? It's about, like, the cursing policy. They made it so that, like, you could still curse. but And, like, sure, it may limit the amount of ads you get, but you could still get ads with cursing. I am pretty shocked that YouTube is capable of making a decision that benefits its creators in any positive way. It's got a new CEO. Yeah, and a lot of people thought he wasn't going to do well, so. Well, this is, I think this is one of the first things he did, and he's, like, people are actually okay with it. Hmm. Okay, but yeah, we gotta end the episode now. Here lately, when a company gets a new CEO, it absolutely just starts burning. But yeah, let's... Uh, wait, what are you doing? We gotta end the episode. I'm prepping up while we end. That way we can just get right into it next episode. Okay, fine. Ladies but, and gentlemen, this has been... Uh, what was this game? Kindergarten, Kindergarten 2. Electric Boogaloo. Uh, nothing electric about this. Uh, we hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Bye.